All right, you get a Harbor Freight nutting amp. Uh, try and figure out exactly how much the uh, draw. Um, I'm gonna try the maximum first and then minimum. Um, anyway, I'm trying to figure out if I can use a, a 12 volt inverter um, for my Jeep, like an onboard welder. So I'm trying to figure out um, how big of an inverter do I need to get. Um, I tried the Harbor Freight one, the 2000 watt, and that keeps on chipping out the uh, reset button. Uh, I don't think it's truly a 2000 watt inverter from Harbor Freight, the uh, the 12 watt inverter that they uh, sell. Anyway, stop talking here and um, see how much draw we get out of a maximum from a 90 amp uh, Harbor Freight. So we're start with maximum right now. So maximum. Second weld. All right. Anyway, like I said, I'm trying to figure out if I can make this work with a uh, 12 volt inverter uh, in my Jeep. Um, plugged into my battery while the Jeep is on. I'm curious if I can use a disc welder here. Do this guy here. You can buy this at Harbor Freight for about, I'm sure you guys saw it, on sale today for about 75 bucks. And that's the newer version too, so it's black Harbor Freight welder. But anyway, we'll see. Keep you guys posted. Thanks.